Hello, welcome to the first lesson of basic drawing. My name is Sergin Babazi. And I am Harman Gabriel Debek. We are both trainers at Creative at School. We will have a series of four videos about working drawing of sample vanity. Let's start with isometric projection of sample vanity. Enjoy the lesson. Hello everyone. My name is Varen Squizera. I'm a trainer at Riven Relativity School. So today, we are going to start the module, which is called Basic Drawing. The lesson number one is called Isometric Projection. In this lesson, we have two objectives. We, at the end of this session, the runner will be able to differentiate isometric projection from other projection. Then, objective number two, is that at the end of this session, the runner will be able to draw properly isometric projection of sample vanity. I encourage you to follow well and take notes so that later you understand properly what you are talking about. So before we start the session, just you must have introduction about projection. Projection, it's the kind of representation of an object on a screen or on paper by using drawing or by using photography. So in order to make it understandable, let me use this box. So now we have an object. So when you want to, uh, to show it on paper or on a screen, just you are dealing with the projection. And even once you find a photo, of a given object, just this is what you call a projection. Mainly, we have two categories or two types of projection. The first one is what you call pictorial projection. The second one is what we call orthographic projection. So orthographic projection is the projection or the view that we find when the projectors are parallel each other and those projectors are perpendicular to the projection plane. That is why you will see only two dimensions. Now you will see this length and even you will see only the height. That is why in general we call it 2D. When the pictorial we see three dimensions, in the orthographic we see only two dimensions, either length and width or width and height. So now, before we make a drawing, just you must have an overview about drawing instrument. So drawing instrument that we have, we have a ruler, we have drawing pencil, we have divider, we have protractor, we have eraser for erasing unwanted lines, and of course we have set square, we have again compass for drawing cycles and even arc. But for our session, we we'll use special instrument because we are going to use green board. So once you want to draw by using green board, you have to use those special instrument. So they are big compared with the first ones. This is the project that we have. And of course, it's called sample vanity. Uh, this project has 
the length of 900 millimeters. It has the width of 500 millimeters and it just it has the height of 740 millimeters.
Hope you enjoyed the lesson. Once again, we have learned a lot from this. As usual, you can find this video on the e-learning website of Uganda Polytechnic for more repetition. We welcome you again for the next session. Until then, stay safe and goodbye. goodbye.